I love a great breakfast bowl, and I'm gonna show you how to make the world's greatest breakfast bowl from the comfort of your own home. Let's take it to the kitchen. It is time to make a breakfast bowl that is going to ramp up your energy, my friend. You're gonna feel fantastic throughout the day. It's gonna give you more mental focus, and it's really, really simple. We're gonna make a meal that our body can utilize right away. You see, the problem is most people are eating so much that the body has a hard time breaking it all down. People who eat less live longer. It's because the body's utilizing it. So without starving yourself silly, I wanna show you a meal that actually your body can love and it can use and it can boost up that internal energy reserve. Let's get into the specifics of this bowl. We need a good base. And I thought, what better way to make a base than to throw a little asahi into it? Because you can go to these breakfast bowl places and spend upwards of 15 to $20 for a good micronutrient rich breakfast bowl, or you can make one from the comfort of your own home. One thing I wanna caution you towards is making sure that the asahi doesn't have any added sugar. We're gonna use a little Greek yogurt as well. I find that the Greek yogurt that's uh, loaded with prebiotics and probiotics is good for gut digestion in the morning. So I'm gonna put about a half a cup in there. Mm, 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 mm. It's all about that microbiota, baby. There it is. We got some of our Organifi Complete Protein. It has about 20 grams of protein in it. So two scoops of protein right here. This is vanilla, and we want protein because protein first thing in the morning is gonna satiate us throughout the day. And it also has enzymes. A lot of the plant-based proteins that are out there are hard for people to digest, they get gas. This works really well because of the enzymes, and it has full food value, vitamins, it's all organic, and it's incredible. We're gonna add a little almond milk as well so that we can create kind of, a, uh, kind of like an ice cream consistency for the bottom of our bowl. We're gonna add a half a cup of ice, and this is the base. So you may be wondering what the importance of protein is first thing in the morning. Protein is one of those macronutrients that our body loves, and it utilizes real effectively. A good plant-based protein, there's three of them that we use in the Organifi protein. We use pumpkin seed, quinoa, and pea, and the protein's gonna satiate you, it's gonna make you feel full, it's gonna give your muscles what they need to actually burn calories more effectively. Let's actually throw a little uh, MCTs from coconut oil that we have here. You wanna make sure it's not bleached, and you wanna make sure it's uh, unrefined, organic, pressed coconut oil as well. MCTs are great at giving your body energy. It's great for your brain. So let's go ahead and kickstart this. We have our ice cream consistency here. So we are rocking and rolling, look at this. And now we get a whole cadre of other nutrients here that we can kind of pick and choose from. We have some people that are into nut butters that may want a little almond butter or peanut butter on there, a little more fat. We have chia seeds for our fiber. It's gonna help really the digestion aspect of this as well. We got hemp seeds, which are another thing that are loaded with omega-3s, super powerful. We have our blueberries that we got from the garden, loaded with omega-3s as well. Great for the brain, low in sugar, and it helps with the creation of new stem cells in the body. And we have some ketogenic granola, actually. This stuff is really good, it's low in sugar, it's got all the seeds and stuff. You want a little crunch with your breakfast bowl. Granola is something that you can add. We have cacao nibs, which they've done a lot of longevity research on now. Um, and they're actually showing that this deep, rich, dark chocolate is really good at potentially reversing the hands of time. And then we have some goji berries uh, loaded with vitamin C, other immune boosting components. So one of the questions that I get all the time is people are trying to lose weight, so maybe they don't have breakfast and they're fasting and they're thinking that that's gonna help them long term. The reason we, we wanna have something that our body can use first thing in the morning, especially if we're working out, especially if we're uh, using our brains, which our brains burn the majority of the calories anyway, we wanna give our brains fuel so that it can actually perform better, which is why we chose a meal that's high in protein, low in sugar, and also high in a lot of fat. It's gonna satiate us, it's going to put our hunger in check, it's gonna put our cravings in check later on so that we're not craving things that are bad for us. First, I'm gonna start with some granola, just like this, and we're just gonna sprinkle it all over the place for a little crunch. We got some chia seeds for fiber. We got some cacao. Definitely need a little cacao with the vanilla protein. This is gonna give it a nice little taste. We're gonna throw a few hemp seeds in here as well. And last but not least, one of my favorite ingredients, fresh from the garden, is some blueberries. So here is the world's greatest breakfast bowl, my friend. 
Try this out, mix it, match it, any way that you want. It tastes absolutely incredible. And it's not gonna fill you up so much to where your body's using all your energy reserves to digest it. It's gonna keep you light on your feet, light in your mind, and you'll still get your hunger cravings in check. Let's try it out. Mmm, 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 mmm. It's not too sweet, but you do get sweet notes from the monk fruit that's actually in the protein that it's sweetened with, and a little bit in the asahi. And then you get the bitter from the cacao and the crunch from the granola. So you're really covering a, a whole spectrum of taste profiles, which I like. Try it out. Let me know what you think. I'm Drew Canoli. Remember, we're in this together, and I'll see you soon.